Good morning children. Welcome to your history class. Today we will begin with a new lesson, Sources of History. In this lesson, we will learn about material sources, written sources, oral sources, sources of ancient Indian history and precautions to be taken while writing history. Tell me children, how do you learn about the life of people of the past? Yes, if you look around, you will find many sources of history. Now, make a list of the things in your house which belong to your grandparents. Find out an old structure like a temple or building in your vicinity. These things are nothing but sources of history. These sources are our way of peering into the past. It provides evidences of past left by people long ago. It helps us to investigate and try to build an image of life, culture, beliefs, desires, activities and achievements of people in the past. Archaeology helps us to study about the mysteries buried sites and objects hidden beneath. It is said, historians study the past and archaeologists study the sources of past human existence. Do you know children, excavations have revealed to the world many mysterious stories. Let me tell you one such story. In September 2010, a large number of stone tools and weapons dating back to more than 80,000 years ago were found from a dry lake bed in south of Chennai. Hand axes, choppers, scrappers, microlithic tools were found. Isn't it exciting? To learn about our country's rich heritage. Indeed, it's the study of these sources that unfolds the culture of the people, their lifestyle, customs, traditions, festivals, dance forms, music, art and craft before our eyes. Now, let's read aloud and take a quick review of what we learned today. Introduction Originally, historians, limited to ancient manuscripts, used a wide range of sources to achieve an understanding of the past. We will observe in the lesson how history is written with the help of the sources. In the lesson, the sources are compiled and classified. We learn about the efforts made to conserve historical artifacts and structures and such efforts also motivate others to do so. Try this. Make a list of things in your house which belong to your grandparents' time. Collect information about an old structure in your locality. What we will explore in this lesson? Material sources, written sources, oral sources, Sources of Ancient Indian History Precautions to be taken while writing history That's all for today children. Stay tuned for the next history class where we will learn about the three important sources of history in detail. Thank you.